I like this on the go. I am gonna dedicate to my Belarus roommate. Well, this is the roommate number two. Uh, this is roommate. Ultra. I'm not, not very beginning, but from, from the 2006, he was involved in it. I did not spread anything, but but good the other day. The other day, um, you know, his action, uh, the state from the part really only acceptable and appropriate. I will not owe anybody anything here. We're not going to be playing any stupid games like this. Uh, as you have seen, Polish government have came up with some bizarre stuff, like really crazy stuff that I have to respond accordingly to. Well, you know, when you're going to call me a stalker and stuff like this, then uh, that's when we have really nothing really, uh, if there ever was anything at all. Uh, it's like this. This individual, 2005, 2006, we were with him in a Belarus. This was a refugee at one time. And just like other refugees, he got more than just a second chance. So these politicians bought it power, especially. I'm going to put it this way. We traveled all the way to Belarus with him. That's why I don't like, when you say Kaczynski, this is, this, is, this is like the worst option. For Poland, this is the worst option that possibly can be out there. Uh, and, you know, unfortunately, Morawiecki is very dangerous, and so is Duda. But Morawiecki, for Morawiecki, Kaczynski stated that Morawiecki is going to stay forever in his place. Morawiecki is not going anywhere, but Morawiecki is... have a strong indoctrination Soviet... Uh, a Russian, pro-Russian indoctrination is not. Um, look, uh, I'm not pro-German. Yeah, I would just want this country to be a country, not a servitude. I'm not going to say to the Russian Empire, but to the suburb of Moscow, because Russia today is not any kind of empire. Empire of evil is all there is. Uh, Russian people alone suffer tremendously over there. Okay, so I'll go straight to the point. Belaruski was associated with a psychologist I am still interested in. And I understand, which is very, very possible according to her words. Let's see if this were her words. Because when it comes to the Ruskis, uh, you should doubt about absolutely everything. Okay, when it comes to the Ruskis, the Russians, uh, you know, they had silicon masks there too back then, uh, and they, they pulled all kinds of dirty, filthy stuff beyond imaginable. Uh, for one thing, and the whole thing they tried to design in a such a way that would fit them, uh, and it's quite interesting to me because he's trying to pull exactly those same strings right now as per you know, giving me a signals like as if one would be related to her and stuff like this. Might have been at one point, but I'm going to put it this way. Individual is mentally unstable, in my opinion. When I rate his psychological profile, not the one of today only, but the one he displayed on that MK Ultra, I know it was very inappropriate in many ways. Uh, in some ways, I have even deserved that. If you if you have ever heard from anybody saying anything like this, you know anybody that was tortured, subjected to MK Ultra, that will actually go forward and say that he actually deserves something like this, I don't know, haven't heard about. But I'm just trying to be honest with the world myself foremost. Um, when you display bizarre behavior as a staff member. MK Ultra staff member. 
uh, you actually, you know, when you have a control over another human being, like a complete control, as the case was with this individual, had control over me completely. In his surroundings, uh, with he, around his people, himself, he display bizarre type of, uh, you know, quite crazy. Uh, quite crazy kind of stuff, not violent stuff, not that he would be like like the other guy was, like the other Belaruski, Valerio. Uh, it, was, it wasn't like this, but the two are f like brothers, super closely associated, even that he'll say no, he'll say no, that's not the case. You know, when you get bored with something, you should just let it go, but this guy had like similar kind of issue, like the guy from in Slovenia, this guy that, that uh, you know, eventually psychologists, psychiatrists uh, had to take control over him because he started to behave, you know, some people displayed like extremely, extremely low um, intellectual abilities on how to pursue, how to handle themselves when they have a complete control over another human being. And they, regardless of this, regardless of when person is given into, well, let's say, you know, entrusted to someone like this under MK Ultra, still it's observed environment. And some of these people find us in trouble. I think this guy got himself in a trouble. Uh, as far as I remember, his own mama, because we were in a Belarus, we were in Minsk, we were in Vitebsk, and we were in this Warsaw, wherever he's coming from. The money for the apartment, for the business, dripped into their pockets literally from Netanyahu because he gestured that he is Jewish and stuff like this. Uh, this guy is as Jewish as I am. Um, yeah, he's got Jewish features, but other than that, uh, it's just, you know, whatever. Well, not that much, okay, because I wouldn't take bribe and stuff like that. But, you know, a lot of people do. I don't blame them if you get the opportunity to take that. Uh, advantage if it if it shows up uncle with a lot of money from Israel and sips you with a load of money that's I, I don't I don't blame you for that hey man um, this is how they got the money basically uh, but he got in a conflict with a mama who would not allow him into he into her business surroundings into family surrounding business surroundings because it might be true, might be not true, I do not know. I was told back then that he will have to wander around like this, a little bit like that, a little bit like this, till this case gets settled. How much this is true, I do not know. Individual definitely is not uh, some kind of a workaholic and stuff like that. He's got a problem taking shower with the cold water. Um, It's not happy if the, unless the water is completely hot. Um, I don't know how much is true that he did not receive the money from the state, from the Polish state. Uh, claimed this yesterday, claimed this every day, have shown me the paperwork that suggested that and claimed that he was at the police station, I don't know what, and he repeats his story from 2006, 2005, on how he was poisoned and blah, blah, blah. The same, the same thing, that they poisoned him and so on and so forth. Talks a lot about the schizophrenia uh, to intimidate. I'm not really intimidated because I have none. Why should I be afraid, worry about something that doesn't exist in me? But, you know, through it all, Gave the guy every day coffee, two cups of coffee, and the money for the cigarettes on a 20, something like this it was, 20. Because I felt so sorry for him that he would not have the money for the cigarettes, 
And so I dedicated him a quarter of what I get per month uh, just so he could have for the cigarettes. Because this time I got larger installment, I got like 200 zloty. Uh, because I reapplied for political asylum, I felt like, oh, this is, you know, I can give him, borrow him, basically borrow him, but I realized the money I will never see back again. Um, under MK Ultra, this thing was designed in a such a way that, you see, this is where the problem is. Individual by the name Lucas, so called maintenance guy, in our complex and I was not aware of that stuff until after this is important to note yeah, I was not aware of any of this stuff this guy demonstrated to me some kind of under MK Ultra some kind of a clearance for uh, as a special agent something like this how much this is true I do not know uh, but he insisted that kind of stuff on that kind of stuff uh, they showed me badges and stuff like this, special services and so on. And that these people would be creating this kind of environment for me so that some other people from some other place that they don't know about would penetrate into this environment. And so uh, I should just tolerate this thing. And the roommate Hassan, the one who was with me destroying me stuff for seven months, that this is actually, this was a brainwash under MK Ultra, the most severe brainwash I have not even talked about. That this is almost like a father to this psychologist I'm interested in. And everything he will destroy to me, the stuff that he will destroy to me, he will do to me as a favor because eventually he will come out and admit that he did the shit like this. I don't think this day is ever going to happen. And I actually do not think that he has much to do with it. If he does have much to do with it, I'm going to say the psychologist, she's not guilty for anything. I want to stretch some heads clear immediately that it's not going to be because there's some people that tried under MK Ultra to, to use racist issues against her. Uh, it was all kinds of issues. Uh, just you got to be honest with yourself. This is a Russian case. She paid a tremendous price. Her husband, like it or not, became Russian. Her life was ruined. She suffered depression because of this stuff, was crying. She's a female, this is not a male. Now, that doesn't mean that she is worth less than a male. It just means that she should be given the same opportunity, which under these circumstances, not even males have had. In a world of sharks, have found herself under such circumstances that whether she like it or not, she just had to go along. I believe that she probably did gesture me that I'm just going to have to play along this stuff. And I cannot blame her for anything because the, the only thing that did for me is that it made things easier for me to bear with this shit like this. Because when they destroy your stuff ongoing you know, on a daily basis, when they radiate you, when boy, when you have yelling and screaming and snapping doors like you know, once every 10 seconds, slapping the doors and stuff like this. Uh, well, in that case, you better believe in something and you better believe in something beautiful. Um, I just remain to believe in her and I think that I will not distance myself from the people. It doesn't matter whether they are Russian or, or, or Polish or whatever they are. For me personally, that I'm not going to be taking any kind of extreme sides. Uh, if Polish nation is to be born, uh, this is a progressive procedure, and this procedure should always remember uh, the history between the Russian and Poland. And the fact of the matter is Poland would not even exist on a map without the Russia. Germans would swallow one, like you wouldn't believe they already did. Poland already ceased to exist on the map even. These are facts, or facts also are that 
this is a sovereign nation, this is a sovereign country uh, that has its thesis toward economy and prosperity and as a large nation as it is, especially because of that, uh, that should not even be happening to Slovenia, which is just a million and a half, two million people, million and a half natives. Uh, but this is a country with a 40 million people that should definitely decide about, you know, own economy, destiny, and what one country wants to be is, and so on. Uh, and it, as such, should be recognized uh, by other nation by having the right to uh, exercise basically existence, uh, the right to existence. Russians already have Germans who did not even deserve to have for the Second World War. Uh, Italians, of course, French and British don't even go into that. Those are the things uh, that, if they are to happen, must reserve the place. I hope it will happen, but must reserve the place for the tolerance uh, for the relationship between these two countries, especially in other countries. They are related to one another, and especially between the Slavic people. You know, stuff like this, stuff like this should not even be happening. Ah, beautiful train. The MK Ultra started in Grotnikich. I was mistaken. I was very, very mistaken about this event. There is a location over there in the square in Zgirsh, next to Biedronka, where the bus station is, where there is a girl now from. She works like. By the way, I identify like I said. Too much, too many proofs to say no. There is a little store, a cellular shop, where the girl is that is like in a super horrific state. Her age, I don't know, it might be about the same as mine. Might be a few years younger, but not much, I think. And this was actually the first girl I was interested in. Uh, the problem is that this girl was not suitable for me, according to the Polish psychologist, according to Kaczurinski. Um, they wanted to get right from here, from this area here, from Zgirsh, psychiatrists wanted to get the right fit for me. And it looks like that girl, the girl was quite happy to see me. And when she was told, oh, that there will not be the two of us the problems broke out and she pulled the bitter end she pulled the short end uh, she would not go along with these things there were other things that happened parallel to this escalated other problems and before you know uh, they destroyed her. Depression, pills, and today uh, the girl looks like something from the horror movie. Like psychotropic medications which she's taking ever since uh, make her look like completely, completely horrific. Uh, and she is in this little shop, as I was told by this psychologists, psychiatrists, that are also split on many issues and they are split for a very wrong reasons. I don't like racism. I reject it. Poland is a beautiful, beautiful country. Here, here is also diversity. You have, like the German told me today, you have Polish that mixed with Germans, you have Polish mixed with Russians, you have Polish mixed with uh, Jews that used to live here and I'm gonna repeat the same thing I have stated to uh, the American staff member have stated me they come here a lot of Americans come here I hope you're gonna meet guys I'm looking forward to meet you promised me you're gonna come here for a summer time that we're gonna meet but you also said I'll probably be transferred from here before that or something I don't know 
anyhow drop me a mail give me a phone call my phone not working tablet you cannot install phone I am trying to do right now something but I got just too much other stuff I gotta work on things aren't coming along easy because they make them difficult three hours to upload 500 megabytes video this is not any funny you know stuff like that stupid we like to come here to Poland to this area here because it's like this beautiful uh, Jewish women are in Israel but if you want to meet like a really really beautiful woman Jewish woman then you have to come to Poland is what the MK Ultra staff member told me back then I didn't know shit I sh you know I observed some beautiful but I didn't know exactly what he meant by what this and that Netanyahu was here look I know straight for the ladies that he gave them money straight um too much I know about this place too much I know more than what Polish people know about this place and I was under MK Ultra. Statue that stands in Zgirsch, 5,000 Jews killed by Nazis. This is because Netanyahu demanded, conditioned for some kind of a factory, whether it's gonna be this statue right here or there will be no factory. And it's the right thing he did. And it was a big argument because of also because of what he did. He did some filthy stuff, he pulled dirty tricks. He would use me to split the community and had his own Israeli team that would go all over the city's Gersh and would paint uh, David stars and they would bully people with, you know, with F issues and stuff like that and have split society, have created civil war here super hard situation which Netanyahu rationalized as um, if they don't allow us you know if they don't allow us to have a cemetery if they don't allow us to have these things if they don't allow us to uh, you know all sort of things uh, then we also shouldn't do business with them and stuff like this Oh, uh, folks! I would just want you to get along. I was a part of this problem myself. This isn't this isn't cool at all. Okay, let's go back to these Jewish ladies rather than this crazy politic. Okay, um, yeah. If you want to see like a really beautiful Jewish woman, you come to Poland. Well, I can tell you this is this is so true, because the Jews did. Well, this American dude said there was some Trump was a Jew here just as a joke I'm just being joke I joke a lot you have to joke uh, it's like this because some trumpets Trump did them here uh, there must have been a Trump here that was a Jew and that's why so many like this okay the truth is I hope you're laughing about this stuff um, this is true except that they are not Jewish and they have the right to remain Kaczynski something dream, some other poll, something dream on the Ranky Ultra about the options, who will be allowed to stay in uh, Poland, what option will be allowed to stay. Well, I think it's actually a beautiful option and I, I, I embrace the diversity, this kind of diversity. This, this women are just really beautiful, they're gorgeous. Uh, to me, this is an option that I vote would stay. I feel like this about it, you know, these Americans wouldn't be coming back if they wouldn't feel about this stuff like that too. I mean, I'm not the only one is what I'm trying to say, okay? Just the sanity. Lots of racism went on and just this psychologist just happened to find herself many times in all sides of the banks. So this is a female, this is a female that should not be in a situation like this. I have no idea how she even survived this stuff. And they related her to this girl as per her doing bad things to her, which 
definitely is not true because I also know that she tried to help her out, that she tried to assist. She tried to assist everybody. Fact of the matter is that psychologists, psychiatrists have decided her to be the fit for me. And I guess she went with the flow. And she did like me. And so they reorchestrated the situation I have suggested on documentary about her, how I opened up my eyes and I saw her for the first time. This is how it was. This is how they wanted to present this stuff. Yes. Because under MK Ultra you can change the course of events, timing. I'm talking about the timing. I'm talking a lot about the timing. You can do so because the victim does not remember according to the timing, you know, everything, when, what took place and so on. So yes, that stuff can be done. That stuff actually was done. The pills alone, pills, I'm going to put it this way, American, I have heard him saying, he had a relationship with a Polish girl, intimate relationship, not only with one, with quite a few. The, uh, MK Ultra, this is very related to the sex. I mean, this was sex, sex, almost nothing else but sex. And in Elon Musk's case, drugs too. They had pills, they give you a pill that is a paralyzer. A sleeper that will place you to sleep. Primary effect is to simultaneously parallel uh, to the sleep, which is a primary effect. Paralysis take effect, uh, and it's, uh, it affects your neural system to the point that you are just uh, without any, I'm gonna say, absolutely any initiative. You can be afterwards pulled back to, uh, like, awake. Almost it feels like you are awake. But it's not like this. You're paralyzed. You are just, you know you're there physically. But you're not yourself. You don't have any initiative. You don't have anything going on. Unless you're challenged, unless you are bullied, unless you are stimulated, I should say. It's not so bad to be bullied, I'll tell you, because none of the stuff I would know, they wouldn't bully me a little bit. Sometimes it was unpleasant, you know. But that's how they saved my life. I hope I get a life out of this. No LSD, no LSD, nothing like it's written on a Wikipedia, LSD, 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 no, 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 no. In this case, not. In many other cases, yes, I would say, in this case, no LSD, zero LSD. I do not remember a single time to have any kind of trip, anything that I would, like, feel like a regular, like, I don't know, uh, what, fly or whatever is that people with LSD, I have no idea. None of the kind of stuff, I don't know nothing about that stuff. The only thing I know, it's what I told you about. You're, like, brought, like you know, to senses, which under no circumstances you can defend yourself or whatever. You're just there and there's nothing you can do, nothing you can do. And you're told your commands to perform whatever you, you're you told and that's exactly, basically is what you do. That's all there is. This was my case. And so, yeah. It was about money. LSD would not really do any good. If they would use LSD, it could cause really probably long-lasting damage, you know, that uh, it would not maybe even allow me to recuperate myself from the stuff. But they did use electroshocks. That's a bad stuff. To clear the memory, they did that kind of stuff. I know they did that. You're not talking about electroshocks like the ones you see in a in a in a mental hospital when you're when you do with the people stuff that is just uh, completely outrageous. But they had certain things like apparatus that electrodes, small little portable stuff that they they use to uh, to do the stuff like this. I know that.
No such thing as division. I don't want any kind of division in that field. Uh, if anybody has a doubt, this is like a little shop with a cellular accessories. This girl is inside of that store. When you see something like this, you're going to be scared like you would not believe. And so the war broke between this racially divided psychiatrists, psychologists. Some who wanted nothing but bad things to this psychologist who actually did save my life too, I think. She pledged herself to keep me alive, really, literally. Because they wanted to... What I created was no, it was no good. Okay. She really did. Uh, that's why I say this is a good woman. This is an awesome woman. The problem is, however, when I think about Belaruskis, when I think about stuff like this, when, you know... This is the stuff I'm afraid of. This is, this is the stuff that scares me. But then again, how much this is related to what, in reality, I do not know. The only thing I can tell about the Belaruski is a rat. Try to intimidate is a provocateur. Is try to emotionally exploit person. You know, because you entrust yourself to him and... He gives you again information, some information, so he can gain your trust. Then what he does is he turn into emotional vampire by causing you damage, by suggesting like like trying to abstain like emotional response from you, gesturing like how can one possibly be doing stuff like this to you and stuff like this. You know, and all along, adding to that, what kind of MK Ultra and stuff like this. Talking about stuff that I appreciated because it related to MK Ultra alone. Uh, because I can tell you we were in a Belarus. I can tell you the Borat Pahar was in a Belarus. I can tell you we were in the villages where they have people who are descendants of. Uh, people who became schizophrenics because of the World War II and stuff like this. They have a special villages like this. I understand. This is again what I was reminded. And I remember some kind of villages over there in the Belarus we were. And I remember some kind of lakes too. And we were on the lakes and stuff like this. This is good stuff. What's bad is stuff I have mentioned. He displayed instability when, you know, when we were away from from others uh, quite some wild behavior and he related that instability also to this girl with I do not know or she alone might not know everything about and so on and so forth I have no idea if anything and stuff like this at all it's cloudy stuff that's why I'm not gonna draw any conclusions on her yet but I'm still interested in her I still want to go forward with this thing in respect to her relationship. Is observing along with emotional exploitation, which became gradual, systematic. Everything you do, everything you place, stuff like this, let's say. And he will go for it. Boy, I stepped inside of the restroom. I left this under the pillow. The only thing I know is, is he took... I was going to go right back. The thing is that you go to the restroom. You hear him taking... Um, he's about to wear his shoes and walk out. You open the door, you go... Look immediately straight for this because you know you left this and you know that he make a move. And this thing already is placed on another location, meaning that either he was going to take this thing out or do some other stuff. You cannot delete from this stuff here unless you plug this in the computer because it's designed in a such a way that it will not delete stuff. 
you cannot manually cannot delete anything from here it only can be deleted by computer luckily this thing did not go with him out of the door but if it would I would know who to go I should say around after it was placed on another side of the battery so basically letting me know that he did this another specialty is was attempt to screw me up one time with a coffee because I spelt because it's a round uh, toilet unlike inside of the other room it's a round cover from the toilet and I don't know how much you remember but this thing is completely completely scratched with the paper and I cannot see Jack with his glasses really these are the same glasses I have I'm half blind really and so I don't see it I don't know the surface beside that I get little sleep beside that I am with a hypertension already for it started in 2017 uh, excuse me 2017 um, and it's now 2019 I, I am already with this hypertension like this for over one year okay almost one year and 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 I don't know four months without getting enough sleep and so on it's easy to agitate somebody I'm just saying this I'm not agitated in any way I'm not controlled in any way they try hard but it doesn't work an interesting boy is that when you clean everything inside like I do I'm so clean boy it was this coffee's Bojova not a real coffee but just uh, some form of uh, baked oats something like this that tastes a bit like a coffee not a real coffee at all there's no caffeine in one and this thing had fallen down to me because of this cover guess what after I cleaned this he went twice I would find the stuff over and over and over again inside of that toilet that that would reappear out of where would that thing reappear when you clean one today I took a shower <laughs> and guess what I left for the day and I came back uh, went to the breakfast shower at 8 7 30 uh, breakfast at 9 as I came back at like 9 30 it was everything wet inside of the uh, inside of the bathroom with hair on the floor today I what I washed the hair and I asked him I said why uh, I said because I keep saying this to Hassan to the other roommate please please clean the toilet the shower area after yourself so it's not going to be steamy inside open the door clean the floor dry the floor so it's not going to be paddles of water on the floor and so on which he does never does this he goes inside and deliberately does this up to date the guy stink like a hell he just go I don't know what he does at all he goes inside the whole thing stinks so much that that it, when you go when you try to go inside it will throw you out and so on and I said why is this I said please Yuri I said please could you please you know just clean this paddle so it will not be water like this I see the hair follicles on the floor which are definitely not mine I did cut the hair yesterday though I did but this is short the hair follicles I have found are about like this size which I have not cut anywhere meaning that either would be his hair or it would be from the Hassan the water I absolutely clean one from the shower so what the guy is trying to do is he counts on a Polish immigration that would border patrol officers that would get in and he would point out that I'm leaving like the stuff inappropriate dirty stuff uh, behind myself and so on and he's also very good with the Hassan faking the stuff like I'm inside of the shower 
and they are recording the stuff and it's a conversation they start and they'll try to plant like saying the Russian words you don't even understand language and indirectly try to obtain statement from you such as yes or something like this or between the two talking to one another saying like this how can I say you're on a I'm on a, I'm inside of the shower area but the difference between when you're inside of the shower is only that you don't see the person outside but as far as voice quality you will be having trouble to discern between the two so what you can do is you can create communication which it will look like you know like you're engaging in the communication and it's between the two and the whole thing might look like you know not talking to you directly at all so you don't see who is what they're talking and it, it can look like like it's talk between the two of you when in fact it's talk between the two of them so it's manipulations manipulation with the voice and stuff like you try to obtain false statements through this kind of techniques as well Hassan tried to intimidate yesterday with the idiotic issue as per my gesture in the news side that he's suffering from depression because of his continuous <laughs> It's not even like this. It's like this. It's like you're crying. Not like this when you're sneezing. But it's like you're crying. Like this. And you can hear this. Came up with idea that he had screws, metal screws here because the bump have fallen something like this in Chechnya and as a result of that he suffered injury do you feel sorry for him? I do not not even a little bit because he's a con man, he's a criminal as hard as one can be for that issue I was told that he is related to psychologists and whenever I would not be working doing my stuff the best performance which parallel to that they had done everything possible to screw you so you could not do anything at all it would be like a signal to me that it will end the relationship will end so this is a total effing lunacy and it's bigger lunacy than this is that the fucking guy you are with for seven months inside of the room is doing shit like this and he doesn't actually tell you why the fuck he's doing this this is a complete psychotic complete criminal but thanks god I did obtain well a verbal statement from him that he never mentioned this issue before because he wanted to intimidate me with one like look how poor I am this and that I said oh really and you have hidden this from me for seven months and then he goes well I didn't feel like I want to talk about it because it was uh, it it's emotional oh it's emotional we are emotional now you see he's emotional you see this is the type of stuff we're dealing with here and he goes but my heart is clean sure it's clean sure it's clean I'm gonna give some more update about the stuff that is destroyed the packages are open from Polish mail that arrives and items are already destroyed before I get them in the hands the same situation again as this is in Slovenia and I'm gonna be very detailed about that stuff too that's the roommate from the Belarus I better watch my back and I should award behavior like this I should I should believe I should believe in a stuff like this I should award 
the stuff like this because the stuff like this is good for me. It's a lunacy, especially when you think about you were accused by police station of stalking and shit like this. Police alone that is involved in an MKUltra case. And the question only is how far will you allow for the lunacy to go on? And so I decided to stop one. Regarding the Lucas, it's like this. You know, it was orchestrated in a such a way that I would not get the money this time inside of the center. The money was supposed to get in the tent, I finally understand. But I got this money on the 14th, all through the paper was given to this individual, or it might have not been, it might have been inside of the office on the 13th already. So anyhow, on 14, on 15, I did go to the postal office and I did retrieve this money. I was certain, however, that I would receive another another money because they mentioned something that it was all kinds of hocus pocus that you get under MK Ultra. It's, it's a real problem. This brainwash. Uh, they brainwash it so well, boy, that there's going to be additional 70th lot you will get. I didn't know if I'm going to get or not. The problem, however, is along this brainwash, the Belaruski claimed he did not get the money. In fact, yesterday he claimed he still didn't get the money. Yesterday, yesterday was the 25th. He should get this money on the 10th. Other people stay just as I have right now. They got the money already. But this guy would go as far as giving me a document like this in the face that, that he wrote the letter attorney letter and stuff like this so you you really don't know what's going on and my giving him a coffee my having yet another belarus polish guy now this is a different species this is a polish guy who escaped from belarus because he was mistreated he just couldn't go along with their political bs it's an older guy it's a really good guy he also gave me account that he was in Poland already 16 years ago, just as I asked him for 2005, 2006. I got a lot of audio recordings coming. This is going nowhere. Everything is going to come out one way or the other. With the cigarettes, you know, when you when they assemble the cigarettes with the tobacco and with these filters, they get them together, they fill this thing, and it's a cheaper option. When they had this boy inside of the room, they, they were assembling this stuff, and so I was damn sure that I give him a coffee, I give him this. He eventually will, uh, you know, be okay. But then the whole thing started to get to me even stranger because on the 19th he started to complain that he's going to start to go on a hunger strike and stuff like that. Uh, that he still didn't get the money. So now I'm saying to myself, well, the guy, tobacco, this can be a serious problem. And I really want to make him as easy as possible. Uh, after a while, if I would go to the city, this was after a while. He would go and also collect me a food from a dining room and stuff like this. And so I felt like obligated, like giving him, you know, uh, a money for this cigarette so he can go buy himself. You know, I get this money, this 200 zloty. I said to myself, go, boy, buy yourself these cigarettes, whatever. In fact, I was going to go buy them in Zgersh, where are cheaper for 12 zloty. But... I said to myself, I feel so bad for him, I gave him right there. I said, here is 14 zloty, we can two zloty more here. Go buy yourself this tobacco and so on. As I exited the room, I, <laughs> it was total repetition of MK Ultra scenario. Like, get this Lucas with his team going, looking at me like this. It's not like, uh, it was like this. If it's going to be the day such, it's going to be bad. If it's going to be the day such, it's going to be really bad. If it's going to be day such and such, it's going to be bad. Forget it. So, you know, I should go and climb. They try to brainwash me to basically be fucked. 
stripped of the money, can't, and still climb into the S of these people. This is how far this shit have gone. And this Mr. Lucas just happened to be individual. Whom, because of this situation, somehow I do not like. I got to say that. Because involving this kind of emotional, exploitational issue, I can take as a plus, I can take as a plus that you suggested that you will just have to cooperate with the Russians on this kind of issue, or you, you might suffer the same end as other people did who re refused, who rebelled against them. But you got to understand that, you know, you got to understand one thing that one thing is for you to do the stuff, to have the right to do the stuff to me according to whatever you have made, uh, you know, the agreement with the Russians. Then something else comes in a light when you start to try to profit here. They would also have me in some kind of a business company here and they would gesture me on how the money is needed. The money is needed for the company to go on, that there's going to be companies and the stuff like this, so that the money is needed and stuff like this. And, you know, with this kind of brainwash, MK Ultra brainwash, this is just like a really, really negative, very, very negative type of stuff that creates a very negative opinion about you as much as I want to help everybody. Some of these people, they're not all bad, were deprived of their lives, including those in Chechnya. I don't know, the guy from Kazakhstan told me that he is a tourist. They tell me all kinds of accounts. They don't care. They're just here to get the money, to get their stuff going, or so they could pay for whatever was given to them in their countries, whatever. This, many of these people are not even here to stay. Others are staying here but for them, Polish government claims they're across the border in the Germany and so on and so forth. It's a cluster, total cluster. You don't know about what goes on. Other than they're disappearing, going whichever way they want to go, whenever they want to go, whenever they pull them out in front of your eyes, uh, your complaints submitted to police are not taken seriously, but there's all kinds of stuff that, that they lift against you that is taken seriously and so on so you don't know nothing about who is paying what is paying the whole thing is like this as i have explained that was really bad lucas um they dream about something i would be transferred to the Warsaw, and that's why i would be really really destroyed and stuff like that careful what you talk um and so this kind of environment they create would be actually for my benefit all through believe me hypertension does not help reviving your memories uh it doesn't even help you get sleep unless if you consider not getting enough sleep is a plus and so on and so forth it it looks like it's gonna rain boy the heavy hour is coming so i'm about to go from here and end this video and for that matter i should reward them Look, I do love to reward people that deserve to be rewarded, but for that matter, you're going to have to, you know, effing hold yourself accountable for, uh, you're going to have to pay this in some kind of form, and that's not going to be only through abuse. You're going to just have to give really some witnessing account as well as mine and say the truth about it or you can forget about it all that's all i got to say about this video uh the belaruski uh number two is just really not a person that uh you know i would want to stick around the people like this uh, i think this is well explains uh, why per why this kind of issues and so on Give me a few leads, which I'm going to use uh, to gain trust, but then turn the whole thing in like completely different level. Once they get trust from you, you are like this. Thanks for watching this video. Till next time.